Happy spooky season, everyone. I'm Violet. I'm Emily. And I'm Ayla. So since it's October here, we here at the Hot Dog Network thought it would be a great idea to read you guys some spooky stories. Since, well, Violet, would you mind telling them? Yes. So in the spirit of spooky season, we will be reading you guys some scary stories. We want you guys to know that here at HGTV, we want you guys to enjoy the spooky season even when we can't. But please understand that we do not mean for anyone to get freaked out by these stories. As Ayla said, we want you all to enjoy these stories as much as we enjoyed finding them for you. So Ayla, what story do you think we should start off with? Hmm, I believe we should start them off with a less scary story. Oh, who am I kidding? Let's throw them in head first with a good one. What you say, Violet and Emily? Let's do it. But which one is that? The cell phone? Nope. We got I see everything. And from what it from what I read, it's really good. Nice. Let's get started. I was with my little brother home alone when suddenly we heard a creepy voice from the other room saying, Panda, Panda, come here, I want to talk to you. We didn't know who or what it was and immediately ran upstairs. While we were running to our room, we heard someone say, Do you boys think you can run from me? I see everything. At this point, we were terrified. Locking our doors to our room, grabbing our mini baseball bats and crying. We, we were certain we were going to be killed or eaten by some monster. Then it happened. A loud bang came from the closet and the monster sprang out. We both screamed. My brother fell. I threw the bat at my dad wearing an it clown mask laughing hysterically. Turns out he was behind the whole thing. First, he had put all the cordless phones in the house on speaker and he said he was going to leave to run some errands. Then he proceeded to sneak back into the house, hiding in our closet, and scaring us. Wow, so it was the father the whole time? Great father, if you ask me. Well, everyone, thanks for watching. See you next time, everyone. Yeah, thanks for joining us today.